Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing an infill and a redesign on the lovely summer. So this was the Barbie set that I filmed a few weeks ago. And I'm going to start by going in with my e-file and just removing those nail decals and also removing the bulk of the acrylic. I already went and removed the crystals um, off camera, so to remove those I just used um, an old cuticle nipper and just clipped away at those. Um, but I did do that off camera, but that is on a couple of other videos on my channel if you wanted to see that. But all I'm going to do then is just go in and remove the bulk, so I'm just going to let you guys watch this part. With this nail, Summer did snap it, um, so she did glue it back together and glue it back down. So what I did for this one is I removed as much as I could of my e-file and then we removed the whole entire nail and just started fresh on that nail. Um, when I do the infills, it is on the other hand because for some reason I didn't press record on this hand, but they were the same on each hand, so it doesn't matter, but yeah. So once I'd finished with the e-file, I just went in with my hand file, just refined the shape a little bit more and also removed any little bits of lifting. And I also went in with my cuticle drill bit to get rid of that dead skin off the nail bed. Then I went in with CJP Acid Bonder. Acid Bond, sorry. Applied that to all of the nails and now I'm just going in with glitter bells, glass slippers and infilling all of the nails. I've left this in um, at normal speed for you so you can see how slow <laughs> I work. It looks really, when I'm actually doing nails it feels like I'm doing them really really quick um, and this set took me about an hour and 15 minutes but for some reason on here it looks like it's really dragged out and really slow but a few of you have asked for me to keep them in at normal speed, so I have. I do think I speed it up at some point, but I can't remember where. But for now, we're at normal speed.
So once all the nails are fully set, I just go in with my 100 grit hand file and just file those nails. So I do the side walls, the free edge and the cuticle area and then also the surface of the nail and then I'll buff over with a buffing block. So now on the pinky, I'm going in with this beautiful colour from Madame Glam. This is called Positive Tomato and this is one from their new collection that will be available from June. Um, on the 3rd of June at 10pm UK time, I will be doing their live launch on YouTube. So make sure you come and join us. And then I'm going in with another new one from their collection. And this time I'm going in with Gentle Coral. And this again is another beautiful colour from their new collection. They are just stunning. They're just so pretty. So all I do is go in with these two colours and then we're going to set that for one minute under my LED lamp. If you are using a UV lamp, don't forget you need to set for two minutes. Now I'm just going to go in with my second coat and again we're going to cure this for one minute under LED and two minutes under UV. So now on the ring finger and the index finger, I'm just going in with Neo Nails Urban Graffiti Base Coat. And I'm using this because I'm going to be applying some foils. And I just think this is amazing stuff when you want to work with foils. So apply that to the whole nail on the index and the ring finger. Cure that for one minute. And now I'm going in with Glitterati Holographic Rose Gold Foil. And I'm just wiping the back of that with some alcohol rub and just pressing that onto the cured base coat. And as you can see, it's perfect. Then all I'm going to do is go in and top coat all of those nails using my Glitter Bells No Wipe Top Coat. Cure that for one minute. Then once they had cured and cooled down, I then went in with some cuticle oil and that is the finished look. 
So I really hope you like this one, guys. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, click subscribe. And don't forget to join me on the 3rd of June at 10 p.m. live on YouTube for the launch of the new Madame Glam collection. I'm so excited and I'll see you soon. Bye.